Let us determine the free surface moment of the four-peak tank since it is considered a slack tank. But before I proceed, kindly check the link in the description for part 1 of this video, how to determine the volume and mass of the ballast water inside the tank. When we say slack tank, it means it is a partially filled tank or a tank on board that is not full or pressed up. When the ship rolls, the liquid inside the tank will move at the low side and the effect will be a virtual rise in the ship's center of gravity. And that effect is called a free surface effect. So we need to take the free surface correction of all slack tanks on board in order to find the fluid kg and fluid gm. Based on the given problem, the sounding of the ballast water inside the four-peak tank is 156 centimeters. The value of the free surface moment can be seen in the last column of this table. If you inspect the sounding value in the first column, there is no sounding of 156 centimeters. So we need to take the next lesser sounding value which is 150 centimeters and the next higher sounding value which is 160 centimeters. The free surface moment at a sounding of 150 centimeters is 5.2 ton meter. And for 160 centimeters, the free surface moment is 6.1 ton meter. In this scenario, we will have a single interpolation. I will use the FX82 MS calculator for this particular interpolation. If you are using FX991ES calculator, kindly check the part 1 of this video. To interpolate using a calculator. First, we need to set our calculator to regression mode. Click the mode button. Click number 3 to choose the regression mode. But if you have installed this kind of calculator on your Android phone, you need to press the scroll button to the right, and then press number 2 to choose the regression mode. This is the only procedure that differs from the real FX82MS, the rest of the functions are all the same. After pressing the number 2 or 3 which is the regression mode, choose linear so press 1. Your calculator now is in regression mode and ready to be used for interpolation. Enter the sounding of 150. Press the comma button. Enter the value of free surface moment at a sounding of 150 centimeters which is 5.2. And press the M plus to save in the memory. Next, enter the sounding of 160. Press the comma button. Enter the value of 6.1 and press the memory plus. Next, enter the required sounding which is 156. Press the shift button. Then press number 2. Press the scroll button to the right three times. Select the Y symbol, so press number 2. And press the equal button. The free surface moment at a sounding of 156 centimeters is 5.74 ton meter. But if we look at the sounding table, the given values below are obtained based on the relative density of the ballast water of 1.025. However, the relative density of ballast water that has been filled into the four-peak tank is 1.016. So we will make some corrections. The actual free surface moment is equal to 5.74 ton meter times the relative density of the ballast water inside the tank which is 1.016 divided by the relative density specified in the sounding table which is 1.025 so the actual free surface moments of the ballast water is 5.69 ton meter next we will determine the vertical center of gravity or VCG of the ballast water inside the four-peak tank at a sounding of 156 centimeters. This value is needed in finding the final kg or the vertical distance of the ship's center of gravity from the keel. In this column, you can find the value of the VCG. Since the sounding of 156 centimeters cannot be found in this column, we will take the next lesser and the next greater sounding value, then we will interpolate. The value of VCG at a sounding of 150 meters is 1.29 meters. At a sounding of 160 meters, the VCG is 1.36 meters. 
To interpolate, I will use the FX 991ES plus calculator this time. If you are using FX 82MS, just play back this video on how to interpolate using this kind of calculator. First, switch on your calculator. Press the mode button. Select the stat, so press number 3. Then select this equation, so press number 2. For column X, we will enter the sounding value. For column Y, we will enter the corresponding value of the free surface moment. So enter the sounding of 150, then press the equal button. Next, enter 160, and press the equal button. Press the scroll button to the right once. And then press upward twice. The position of the shaded rectangle should be here. Next, enter the VCG value at a sounding of 150 meters which is 1.29 meters and press the equal button. Then enter 1.36 and press the equal button. This is what the screen of your calculator looks like. Next, press the AC button to save it in the memory. Enter the required sounding value which is 156. Press the shift button. Press number 1. Select regression, so press number 5. Then press number 5 again. And press the equal button. The value of free surface moment at a sounding of 156 centimeters is 1.33 meters. Since the liquid inside the tank is not affected by the density. No correction is needed for the VCG whatever the relative density of ballast that has been filled into the tank. If you like to know how to determine the volume and mass in this problem, kindly check part 1 of this video, the link is in the description below. That's all for now guys. Thank you for watching.